Once a shortage eases and numerous new drugs are introduced to the market, the demand for anti-obesity medications is anticipated to increase dramatically this year. The medications must be taken indefinitely, but they cost $1,000 or more per person per month. How much prevention can individuals and the nation afford when more than 40% of Americans are overweight enough to be eligible for these medications and the majority are currently ineligible for coverage? Doctor. Marcus Shabaka, President and Chief Executive of ECRI, a nonprofit organization working to advance healthcare, said, We appreciate that. The pharmaceutical industry continues to look into anti-obesity drugs. If most patients who require it cannot afford it, it simply does not help. More than 2 million prescriptions for Wegovy, the brand name for the Novo Nordisk drug semaglutide, and for Terzapatide, an Lily diabetes medication that hasn't yet been approved for weight loss, were written in the past year, according to health technology company Komodo Health. This year, it's anticipated that these medications will be more widely accessible due to rising prescription demand. It has been demonstrated that tozapatide can reduce extra weight by an unheard of 15% and 20%, respectively. They are also anticipated to lower medical expenses and, consequently, health repercussions. Dr. David Ryan, Chief Medical Officer for the Institute for Clinical and Economic Review, which calculates the cost-effectiveness of various medications, stated that obesity is a significant medical issue in the United States. We've been waiting a pretty long time for medications that do anything like this.